Now, hold on to your hats. Here's a 17-year-old who has planned two quads. We've got 10 skaters, would you believe, going for quads here, or say they are. And here's one of them. Zheng Jingguo, he's 17 years old from Harbin in northern China. He's in 22nd place. First, the axle. Triple axle, double toe. Confidence boosting start. Now the next jump should be the quad. So we're one out of one on quads tonight. How on earth can this happen? A 17-year-old in the first group sticking a quad. Where is the sport going? Triple loop. The thing that impresses me is that there's no setup for these jumps. And the Salco out of nowhere, another triple. quad with a double toe loop on the end. is fallible, just came for a triple that's triple toe loop with hardly any speed. Oh, he's looking very tired now. His weight's rocking backwards and forwards on the skate. Crowd trying to help him through the last minute. to the triple flip.
Well done. Look at the mouth, wide open, sucking in air. But he's made a certain kind of history himself. The first man in a world championships in the opening group to do two trip, two quads. And, uh, well, it's just going from strength to strength, the whole thing. Just count them through. There was the first. Here's a look at the triple Lutz. Brilliant technique. And so much courage shown with the triple Lutz trying to get the triple toe on the end. He had a, a real stumble going into the Lutz at the beginning. And uh, most people wouldn't have even attempted it, but he had the audacity to go for the triple toe at the end. And you can see he didn't get the full rotation. And here's that quad toe again. Marvellous. Well, later on, Elvis Stoiker is going to attempt a quad-triple combination. He's already pulled it off once in the Grand Prix Finals. But this young man at 17 years of age. Well, you feel that he could do a uh, quad-triple combination as well, looking at the quality of those quads. Yes, artistically, it wasn't as strong as we've seen, so he's going to go into third place. But he hops in front of Michael Hopfis. So he does move up a place, and it may well be that he'll move up some more. And all of this puts extra pressure on Stephen Cousins. This is the group behind him performing like this. What will the future bring? Next year, everyone will be doing quads. You won't be a self-respecting skater unless you can do a squad. A quad. It's half in jest to say that. Yes, I wonder if they'll uh, open it up so you can put one in the short program. So. That's the situation at the moment. Laurent Tabel leading. Second place, Michael Tielsen for Denmark. And then Jin Jingguo for China. Stephen Cousins on the ice, warming up. You'll be back to see him perform right after this.